Hello again. All right, today's lesson is on angle theorems for triangles. This is lesson 7.2, and this is the summary. We're going to go through it. I promise to give you something worthwhile in the middle of it. For those of you paying attention, uh, for those of you just joining, you'll learn something soon. So uh, this one actually has two little breakthroughs, and it's divided in half to make it a little easier to understand. It says, if you know the measure of two angles in a triangle, you can subtract their sum from 180. The difference is the measure of the third angle. That's called the triangle sum theorem. The TST, the triangle sum theorem. So the two angles in this one are 60 and 55, which says, hey, if I take 180 and I minus whatever they add to, which is 115, I get 65 degrees, and that would be my last angle. So let's use that triangle sum theorem a couple times here to kind of find some answers. So it says, find the measure of the unknown angle. Well, we got two angles that we know. One is 55 degrees. One is 72 degrees. When we add 55 and 72, we get 127 degrees. We subtract that 127 degrees from 180. So 180 minus 127 is 53 degrees. So the measure of the unknown angle is 53 degrees. Yay, 53 degrees. I'm going to put it over here because I like labeling things. It just seems like fun. So here we got another one. Find the unknown angle. We got the known angles. The first one is 82 degrees. The second one is 53 degrees. We add them together. We get 135 degrees. We take that 135 and we subtract it from 180 because that's what triangle sum theorem says that the three angles in a triangle add up to make 180. So we subtract that from there and we get 45 degrees as our final angle. I'm gonna stick it over here. So the measure of the unknown angle is 45 degrees. All right, so that's triangle sum theorem on the simple stuff. Let's look at a little more complex when we're dealing with interior and exterior angles of a triangle. Remember, we have exterior angles but we don't play with that remote exterior angle. We own or remote interior angle. We only play with exterior angles. So triangle sum theorem can be taken to mean another thing. It can mean that the two measures or the measure of angle D E G is equal to the sum of the of angle D and that should really say measure there angle D and angle F. So 47 plus 30 equals 77. That means this angle right here is 77 degrees because it's opposite. Uh, you can find the measure of DEF by subtracting that 77 degrees from 180 and you get 103 degrees. Uh, at this time, if you'll happily draw a picture of a balloon right about here, here's my string, and that'll get you 5 extra credit points. Why a balloon? I don't know because I just said it the letter now. So let's use this to solve some stuff here. So I want to find the angle of measure y. I'm looking for measure y. And I know that measure y equals the sum of the two opposite angles from it. So 65 plus 85, that gets me 150 degrees. So I know this angle is 150 degrees. So find the measure of angle x, which is that interior angle there. And together, these are a half of basketball, which is 180 degrees. Total is 180 degrees. So all I got to do is subtract 150 from 180, and I get 30 degrees. And again, I like labeling my stuff. I get 30 degrees. Hey, I hope that was helpful. Uh, if it is, let me know. If it isn't, let me know, and I'll come help. If you ever got problems, please come ask. Thanks.